Hello everyone, I wanted to introduce a new series. This is Celia Lee Jenkins. This book is a classic. It is written by Susan Tan and illustrated by Dania W. Author's Note, which is a fancy way of saying hello. Dear reader, before I start my story, I should tell you that cake is best and there will be lots of it in this book, so get excited because this book is all about my family and our traditions, which are rules that everyone knows. They've been around for forever and have a lot to do with cake. So, for example, on birthdays, it's a tradition to have cake at parties and to bring cupcakes to our class at school. And it's a tradition to have mooncakes with lotus or red bean paste inside on Chinese New Year and chocolate cake whenever my grandpa Jenkins comes over for dinner or else he complains. Even traditions that aren't specifically about cake seem to be there in the end. Like on Thanksgiving when we eat pie, which you can't convince me isn't a cake with a fancy name. So traditions are great and delicious, and I'm excited to write a book all about them. Hopefully you already know me, but if not, that's okay too. I should introduce myself. My name is Celia Lee Jenkins, and I'm nine and a half years old and I'm destined for greatness as a future author extraordinaire. My last book was or will be a bestseller, which is a book that sells the best, and then you're famous and everyone waves when they see you, and you make lots of new friends. I used to think bestsellers were the best kind of books there is, and the only kind I ever wanted to write. But this year in third grade, I learned about a new, better kind of book, which is hard to believe. I know, because bestsellers have best in their name, but it's true. So I decided to write one, and in case you haven't noticed, this book is a classic. A classic is the most traditional kind of book there is, which means classics last forever, and everyone knows classic books and what they're about and who their authors are, because a classic book is everything a book should be, which is a pretty exciting idea. Luckily, I have the perfect story for my classic because my life has a lot of classic themes in it recently and not just because of all the traditions and cake in my family. Right after we learned about classics in school, I found out that this summer my auntie Eva is getting married and there's nothing more classic than love plus romance sells. The wedding will also be an adventure because auntie Eva has asked me to be her flower girl which means I'll wear a big poofy dress and walk down the aisle and throw flower petals in front of all of our families. This is exciting, but also kind of scary, which is pretty much the definition of adventure. So that's another classic theme covered. The wedding isn't for a while, but I'm sure that between my best friend Colleen, my table mate Aylin Face McGee, who's an alien disguised as a human, but friendly, my little sister Gwendolyn, who just started to crawl and chews on everything. And my mom and dad, grandma, grandpa, nene, and yi yi, which are Chinese for grandma and grandpa. I'll find lots more stories to tell you. I'm hoping they'll all be classic themes like quests and epics, battles and struggles and drama and more adventures. But at the very least, I can guarantee you that there'll be lots of cake because dessert is a big theme in my family. So I promise there's a lot to look forward to. I hope you enjoy my story and I hope you can convince your parents to let you eat cake while you read it. Just tell them that it's a tradition so you have to do it. Plus, bonus points if the cake is chocolate or has lotus paste inside. Sincerely, your friend and favorite classic author, Cecilia Lee Jenkins, future author extraordinaire.